I mean, your guys really responded well. Yeah, I think so. It's it's mind over, you know, uh, I don't know if mind over matter is the, the right thing, but it's the will. I mean, uh, uh, we've seen every, a lot of teams and and most of these guys played in the American League and had to go three and three. So it's uh, it's not the end of the world to play back to backs. And, you know, I thought we held on and did a good job there. How good was your goaltender today? It was it was really good, and we're, I'm really happy for him. I mean, he hadn't played in a while. In the last game, he he by him uh, would admit it, that he wasn't as sharp as he'd like to be. But this gets him back into the into the fray, especially when we're playing, you know, 10 games in 17 days. He, he said that uh, he felt a little bit rusty at the start, but the guys cleared the pucks, and as it got went on, he got better and better. Is that what you saw? Well, I saw, I did see that, and I also saw that they gave a, a couple long shots right off the bat. You know, like, I mean, there were shots on goal, but he got a chance to feel it, and, and they didn't get really much in the first power play, and then as the game went on, he got, he got I'm sure he felt more comfortable, more comfortable the whole time. Last night, uh, Matt, you called. You talked about how Matt had made a mistake on that tying goal. Is it good to see him come back and get this one tonight? That's what pros do. You know, I mean, uh, you can get mad at them, but it doesn't mean you don't love them. You know, and just get back out there and, and they show their character and, and have a great game the next night. How important was the PK tonight, I mean, especially in the first period, getting those three kills? Well, you know, obviously, we, we're not a team that uh, wants to get behind too much, so. Uh, it, Getting those three kills, getting out of the first period with, with a lead was really important to us, I think. You haven't had a ton of time with the three-on-three -three overtime this year. The first one didn't go well. What did you like better about uh, how you executed in that area of the game tonight? We changed really well, I thought. You know, nobody stayed on for more than 35 seconds. And you, did, you only had the one time, then it was back-to-back. -back and we wanted to make sure. We thought, and, and if you watch any overtime, you're going to get a chance to score. So as long as we didn't give them too many odd man rushes, I thought we, were, we would get an opportunity to score. You excited to get home, have some days in between games to work on special teams, specifically the power play? <laughs> specifically? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we want to, but we work on that thing every day. So, I mean, it's not like uh, we don't work on it, but it's uh, uh, to get to get home. And, you know, I mean, we play Tuesday, which will be four and six, but at least it's home. We've it, gone through a, a tough stretch where you've played, you know, uh, nine of your first 14 games on the road, and we've come out okay. That's kind of beating a horse here a little bit, but... Do you, do you ever get impressed, I mean, with what Ryan Suter's been able to continue to do? I mean, another short a goal here tonight, start he's had. That's why he makes the big bucks, man. That's what your stars are supposed to do. So, I mean, I want him to continue doing it. Two, I mean, you end this four-game stretch of the road, two wins in three games. You have to, they have to do a lot for the conference heading home. I think so. Like, our goal is every every week to win the week. So, we were 0-2 the previous week, but... That, that goes by. Now let's just say, okay, let's win two out of three this week. And, uh, you know, I mean, we did. We could have won three, but we didn't. But we won two out of three, which is really important.